Bennett keeps it himself. Beats the defensive back. Has another first down for Moore. Uh, it's is it out of bounds? Arizona State jumped up. I think they waved that he was out and down. They are saying he was down. And Brent, watch again how quickly he can get around. I and mean, you love to see these wide receivers from Oregon. If you're going to have big plays in the running game, he's down and the ball is out of bounds. If you're going to have big plays in the running game, you've got to have receivers willing to block downfield. That ball came out and went out of bounds. There is no question they're going to take a look at this. Well, he, I believe that the Early official the play, called him down. The runner was down before the fumble. And the I don't believe he was. No, you're right about that. They're going to take a look at this. This I, is going to cost them a few yards. I want you to watch, folks. This ball's coming out. No question that ball's out. And, Brett, watch the effort here. Watch the effort here. It's, it's airborne, and he now, throws was it, it back. Was the defensive player down when he touched it in the air? Was he out of bounds? He punches the ball before it goes out of bounds, but you're right. Where are his legs? Is, he is his body touching out of bounds as We're he We're talking about the defensive back? player now. Folks, because it was then picked up, the whistle had blown, and Arizona State picked up the loose football. Did he save it? What that effort by Will Sutton. I'm talking about a 290-pound defensive tackle trying to save that football. That look right there. I don't, I don't know if he was touching the. I don't think he was touching the uh, the sideline there. Now Conway is the player who punched it out. Now the problem with this is this official that you see has blown the whistle and has stopped it. Now watch the defensive player right there. He picks the ball, but the whistle has already blown. Okay, they have got a mess on their hands with this one. Yeah, and it began with a bad call that started this. Brent Conway picked it up, if they call it a fumble, but it was Will Sutton who was diving there to, to bat it back. Imagine having to look at this one upstairs. One thing you would think we know for sure is the ball came out before his knee touched. No, there was no question that that ball was a fumble. The very best that Oregon can hope for is that they have the football at the spot where it went out of bounds. That's the very best. The very worst, obviously, is that they turn it over to the Sun Devils. I'm still in shock that Sutton, at nearly 300 pounds, <laughs> is airborne trying to knock that ball back in play. It's a play you expect to see from a safety or a defensive back of some kind, but not a, not a defensive tackle. Showing some pretty good athletic ability there. In this case, you take all the time you need. There's no question. This is not a, it's a pivotal point in the game and a difficult replay to try to work through. Ball is still in play. I, do you see him touch? I don't, I don't think his body touched out of bounds. And the problem is the official has already killed it with that whistle. And they're going to have to overrule that if they turn the ball over to the Sun Devils. I don't think the crowd realizes how tricky this one is. Here we come. After further review, the ruling on the field stands, Oregon ball, first down and 10. Uh, if that's the ruling, it had to do with that whistle. 